Ikachan, presented by Daisuke Amaya, better known as the creator of Cave Story, one of my all-time favorite games ever. So, yeah, Ikachan is a game, and I'm gonna play it blind for the first time. So, if Cave Story is qualifies as my one of my absolute favorite games, I have pretty high standards for Ikachan. Let's go ahead and start. Push Z button. You're welcome. Alright, this is already giving me a Cave Story vibe. Start a new game? No. Oh. What did I do? Greetings from Studio Pixel. Pixel. Use the arrow keys to move, use the Z button to propel yourself, use the S button to open inventory. Enjoy. Oh, thank you, Mr. Pixel. Hey, I didn't want to start a new game! Okay. <laughs> you wake up in an underwater cave. Yeah, this has no relation to the way Cave Star was over. I like that little dancing star guy, look at that. <laughs> Wake up in an underwater cave. Swim, Mikachan! Yeah, this totally does not give off a Cave Story vibe whatsoever. Alright, so we are playing as a little squid guy. Mikachan actually translates to little squid. And I, <laughs> I love the little sound effects that... Um, that he makes it. How do I get in there? Can I get in there at all? I, uh, sorry, little squid pe person, but um, all right. So yeah, this is pretty much like Cave Story, but underwater and with squids instead of robots. <laughs> so I'm assuming those are things I should avoid. So oh. Wow, spikes aren't not insta deaths. <laughs> I'm like here. I am just worrying that the red spikes are insta death, like in Cave Story. Um, but I have health, don't I? No, I have energy. I have one out of four energy. So this is pretty cool music. Like, obviously because Cave Story, and yeah. <laughs> Whoa, what are you guys? Do I have any method of attacking? Wait, can I? Oh, I, I'm supposed to collect these little fish things. These little anchovy sardine things. And those are the enemies. Alright, I got it. So, the fish give me health and the evil fish give me stuff. Or give me death, I should say. Do you have anything to say? Ikachan, where have you been? This place? I'm not sure. It seems to be ruled by a giant fish named Ironhead. Hey, Ironhead. Recently, earthquakes have cut them off from the rest of the sea. Ironhead has all has them all paranoid. To show your loyalty to Ironhead, he makes you carry a pearl around. Without a pearl, you'll be attacked by the locals. I don't have a pearl, so I have to hide down here. Hey, you don't have a pearl either, do you? Are you looking for one? I guess. Okay, but be careful. It's a, it is a very dangerous. It is very dangerous swimming in these waters without a pearl. Alright, so I gotta get a pearl. And I can go inside a clam. How do I go inside the clam? Do I press down? I can... Yes. Would you like to re... Wait. Whoops. Oh. Alright. Oh, okay. So that's like a save point. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Learning all sorts of s awesome stuff. This is cool, and I, and I like the how natural the water physics are. It may not be apparent by just watching a video, but, you know, that's just the way it is. So, is this a skeletal fish? Looks like it. You find something in the fish's re oh, in the fish's remains. I got a spike hat! Sweet, so I'm now spikeified. I am equipped with the abilities to have Mario not jump on me. So, um, but it's not a pearl. I gotta look for a pearl instead of a uh, um, stupid spike hat. Go ahead and save. <clears throat> so yeah, let's go ahead and move on. Wait, does this spike hat now give me the power to... Yes! Break through blocks! That fish does not look very friendly. Well, he does, but he doesn't really look friendly towards certain little squid-like objects named Ikachan. Oh, and I level up. A pearl? I used to have one, but someone stole it. What a jerk. Was it you, kid? Let me search you for it! I guess you didn't take it. Sorry about that. Not everyone around here is nice. Watch your back, kid. Alright. 
Will do, Mr. Seeing Enemy <laughs> Person. You are a funny looking crab, I'm sorry. Whoa, that's a lot of anchovies up there. <laughs> so there's a sign I might be interested in reading. Current sir in this game? I want to talk to you, Mr. First... Mr. Guyface. I don't know why I said where first came from. You can attack enemies with thrusting... Oh, I can attack enemies with your spike cap. Okay, now I can. When you hear this sound... I didn't actually hear the sound because I was talking over it. The enemy was too strong and resisted your attack. Okay, duly noted. So I'm guessing the anchovies are, like, basically the... The same thing as the nachos from Cave Story. Or energy crystals, I should say. What do you say, Mr. Sign? Mr. Oh, can I even read you? Oh, yes I can. Curiosity killed the cat! What's a cat? Cats don't s swim underwater, so nobody nobody knows what a cat is. So, But I am curious. The thing just closed in on me. But luckily I have my spike hat to get out if I ever need to. I'm leveling up all over the place. Suddenly I have 12 health and I'm talking. Like, help. <laughs> and falling into the spikes. All day long! Yeah, another, another thing about water is that the water has momentum. And momentum can get yourself killed if you're not careful. Like, I'm not being careful in the slightest. Ugh, wow, this is surprisingly... Wah! <laughs> Surprisingly pretty tough to maneuver around. Hey, get out of the spikes! Uh, okay, I am one. I am one hit left from dying. One hit from the spikes, at least. Can I not? I. Yee. Hmm. How do I get out? Yee. Uh, this is a problem. A spike hat. If you thrust with it on, you can break through sponge rock and ruin enemies. I, I, I know that, but... Um... I can't get out. Is this like an absolute death room? Because I... Unless I'm missing something. Eeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeee
in the wall there. So, over here, new stuff. First of all, wow, there's a bunch of new stuff. Oh, I'm ruined, the dead man! Oh dear, you're not here to attack me, are you? No, not really. Phew, I'm sorry that I'm so nervous. You see, I'm in a bit of a predicament. Would you like to hear it? Yeah. During one of the earthquakes, I was thrown off this ledge and I lost my pearl! Now only sea creature... Now, oh, now any old sea creature can come and bother me because I can't prove I'm a citizen of Ironhead's realm. Could you find my pearl for me? I would go myself, but we're running out of food and it's vital I protect what I, we have left. Here, I hope this can help you. I got the herbal serum. It looks kind of disgusting. Uh, wow, that, that kind of looks like milk, actually. It's a thick, smelly liquid. Alright, you're not sure what it will do. Uh, do I want to drink it? I'm not going to drink it now. Let's just talk to the sign. Food store- oh, this is the food store. So you're Pinky's dad, I'm assuming. Alright, so... Oh wait, you're blocking my path, so I can't get those anchovies. Fair enough. Fair enough. We need to find the Mother Pearl, it means everything to us. I haven't seen you around before. Are you new here? Take this, it's Ironhead's code! The laws that govern us all. You got Ironhead's code. So, this Ironhead guy is kind of a... Jer... He's kind of a... Dictator, isn't he? Ironhead's code, it reads... Welcome to Ironhead's waters! Strangers can not be trusted, and thus will be attacked! Those of pearls are citizens of Ironhead's realm and are protected from the danger the strangers face. If you have a pearl, do not attack fellow citizens. What goes around comes around. If, and if you're ever caught without your pearl, you might be attacked yourself. Fair enough. So, am I strong enough to... I guess not. <laughs> Swim past the current. Uh, I don't know if I talk to you, so I'm gonna talk to you. All these earthquakes are beginning to worry me. I hope Pinky is okay. Oh wait, you're Pinky's dad. Maybe. So, now that I have this spike hat, I think- hey, I'm gonna avoid these electrical crabs. And- oh, I can go up here too. I wanna see if I can free that little other little squid person from the very beginning of this- Whoa! Wait, where am I? I have no idea. Who are you? Can I eat you? As long as some mother pearls missing, violent earthquakes rock our water, so if you find it, bring it to me at once! Alright, so we're just having new missions all over the place. What do you have to say, Mr. Anemone? That jawfish up there, his name is Carrie. He's Ironhead's right-hand man. If you want to talk to Ironhead, you have to talk to him first. And he seems to want the Mother Pearl of some sort, so... Yes, yes, I know. He has a very bored look on his face. He's like, Man, without the Mother Pearl, my job here is sure boring. Wow, that was, that was some non-joke there, Tor Kirby. So! Uh, yeah, in the clan we go, and I think that just about does it for us. Very, uh, very introduction beginning to Ikachan. Um, I heard this game is pretty short, like, uh, you, game that you can easily finish under an hour or so. Let's just have a little fun with this. I will see, oh, <laughs> and I can kill fishies. Can I kill you, Mr. Fishy? Oh! Oh, you can push me around, but... There you go. And I get no experience from it. Hooray! Alright, anyways, I will see you guys later!